Welcome to this week's Ram Roundup. My name is Kristen Willingeri and I'm here with Fordham Baseball's head coach, Kevin Lee. Coach, your team has won four of the past six games. What do you think has given you an edge to win this series? Yeah, I mean, uh, we, we've just kind of swung the bats you know, pretty good, um, especially with Sal the last two games and then uh, you know, really erupted against Iona. So, um, you know, getting the leads like that, it uh, kind of puts the game away and uh, makes it a little bit easier to you know, play defense and pitch. But, um, you know, that said, we've pitched well in all those games that, uh, that we have won. So, um, you know, that's, that's kind of been the key. Uh, just uh, nothing, nothing completely different or anything like that. But, uh, Scoring a bunch of runs is nice. Speaking of your offense, you have scored 54 runs since the beginning of April. What do you think has caused that? I don't think there's been too much um, different that we've done. Um, you know, it's just uh, I think at times you get hot, and um, you know, as a lineup goes through the game, and you can see the comfort level in the box. Um, you know, hitters wanting to get in the box and, and hit. Um, when they're comfortable. So typically that comfort level and that confidence will result in um, you know, better swings, uh, more hits, hopefully, and obviously more runs. Is that confidence something that you've seen from your upperclassmen? Yeah, you know, when those guys get on and produce, we typically win. Um, you know, so I think if, if they can you know, have good at-bats, um, you know, uh, put the ball in play, put pressure on the, on the opposition, uh, things will work out. How has your pitching staff supported the runs that you have been driving in? Uh, those guys have been pretty good. I mean, we just um, we struggled on Friday, but um, Saturday, Sunday, we needed we really needed those shutdown innings, and uh, and we got it. Um, um, you know, so as I've told our guys day in day out, I feel like we have the advantage on the mound. Um, you know, sometimes you have a bad day, but um, um, you know we've pitched I, I think pretty well to this point. So. What is your approach going to be going into this weekend series against the Rhode Island Rams? You're also foreign to conference play. Yeah, Rhode Island's tough. I mean, we have to be ready. I mean, it's going to be a fight. Um, you know, like I told the guys yesterday, I mean, they pretty much put the first, um, you know, first uh, nail in our coffin last year at the end of their season. So, um, Rhode Island's very good. I think they're similar to us. Um, you know, good on the mound. Um, you know, they, they kind of um, you know, move runners and, and steal bases and, and bunt do all those little things uh, so I, I think the games will be close I think they'll be low scoring um, it's just a matter of you know who can get on who can move them and then who can come up with that big hit thank you all right thanks I am back here with senior Joe Runkel Joe this past spring you've been a finalist for the senior class award what does that mean to you uh, I think it's pretty cool um, all seniors in the country are nominated and it's pretty cool to be 30 of every senior in the country so Something that I'm proud of, and so, um, just an honor to be on with that. What have you done over the past three years that has prepared you for that? Uh, I think the classroom is big. Uh, one part is classroom and GPA. Another thing is the community. Uh, we raised money for the first cancer foundation, also the Wounded Warrior, so that was a big part of it. And then on the field, I went played just about every game since my freshman year, so I have to thank Coach Lane for that for putting me in the every day. So. How is that preparing you for your final season with the Rams? I think it's huge. I've had so much experience. I think I had like over 700 at bats. So since doing this with my freshman year, it's like second nature now. I'm just so comfortable on this field since I've played so many games. So. And you've just moved on to the top 10 all time hitting list for the Rams. How has that been? Uh, it's pretty awesome. Uh, again, I've been playing for four years. So uh, going out there every day, just trying to do the best I can, uh, put the ball in play. Uh, use my speed, try not to strike down so much. So that's all I try to do there. What are you trying to accomplish this weekend against your series? Um, every conference series is big. We want to obviously win the series. Uh, two would be great, uh, three would be awesome. So that's what we're looking for. We've got to win the game one. And we look forward to Saturday and Sunday. What's something that you've seen your fellow students do to contribute to your season? Um, I'd say leadership. We have a couple of young guys. We've got a lot of junior playing too, so just setting an example. Um, there's guys in scoring position early in the game, trying to knock them in. Um, doing what you said, stepping up. Thank you. Good luck this weekend. Thank you. That will do it for this week's edition of the Ram Roundup. As always, thank you to head coach Kevin Layton and senior Joe Runko.
come out and support the Rams this weekend as they face off against the University of Rhode Island. Friday's game will be streamed on the A10 network, and Saturday and Sunday's game will be on WFUVSports.org. For up-to-the-minute updates, check out at Fordham Baseball on Twitter, and be sure to go to FordhamSports.com. For WFUV Sports, I'm Kristen Thelen-Jerry.